Hi guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. Obviously, this coronavirus thing is still going on. Not sure how that's possible. It's been 31 days, but we're still going at it. Today's video is going to be a little quarantine lookbook type of thing. Comfy outfits you can wear while you're at home, while this pandemic's still going on, because it's probably going to be here for quite a while longer. This video was originally supposed to be a spring lookbook, but obviously we got to improvise, so I figured I'd show you guys some outfits you can wear that aren't pajamas but are still really comfy. Wear them around the house and feel a little cute even if you're not doing anything all day. It always boosts my mood and makes me feel a little more productive to actually get ready. So I'm gonna stop rambling on and just hop right into this. I'm gonna clean my mirror off and I'll be right back to show you guys all five super cute outfits on my really ratchet door mirror because my mom is on a call in her room where I usually film with her huge mirror. So BRB cleaning this off because it's a nasty and I'll be right back to get started on these, in my opinion, really cute outfits. Mirror is cleaned and here we go. This is outfit number one. You obviously can't see the whole thing because this mirror really won't allow me to zoom out. So I'll leave a picture right here and I'll also be linking everything down below the description box that I show in this video in case you guys want to get any of this stuff for yourself. Do some online shopping. This still looks dirty, but it's just a reflection. Anyway, again, this is outfit number one. I really, really love this outfit and it's just so comfy. I feel like it's perfect for a day at home and you can go outside and take your dog for a walk and not be in your pajamas. Anyway, this top is from Brandy Melville and a little life hack whenever you guys wear sweaters or anything like that is to always or not always it honestly depends on the sweater but I think it's super cute to do with flowy shorts like this front tuck because if I pull this out it's kind of like eh, you know but if I tuck this in in the front and then kind of pull it out a little and let it flow down like this it looks super cute and it looks like a whole different outfit in my opinion so love the color of this top it's a little big on me because it's Brandy Melville so it's the one size fits all but it's super super comfy I need to go through these a little faster because I'm talking too much but PSA, I'm vlogging right over there and that video is going up next. So stay tuned for a little behind the scenes of this video. Okay, moving down. Shorts are from Princess Polly Boutique. I am obsessed with these. I've been wearing these nonstop and these have a super stretchy waistband so you can eat all the snacks you want. And then finally, my favorite slippers of all time. What is on the ground? That's a little fuzz from something. Anyway, my favorite slippers of all time. These are just like the Ugg slippers, but I got them for like 20 something dollars on Nordstrom Rack. I have worn these every single day. They are the best and they feel and look almost identical to the Ugg slippers. So that is outfit number one. Again, everything's linked below if you guys want to get anything and moving on to outfit number two. What's up? Here's outfit number two. This is my second favorite outfit. My favorite is coming soon, but I just think this is perfect for shoe. I got to go to the grocery store or another really good dog walking outfit. And this is probably the most like dressed up, put together one. I feel like this is the perfect epitome of a casual outfit because on the top, you're like a little dressed up. You get the bralette, sweater, hat, all makes you look a little more put together. But the leggings are super comfy and you have everything. I feel like it's just the perfect casual outfit. So starting off with where everything is from, this hat is actually my dad's. It's says Yellowstone on it and it just went perfectly with this whole outfit. I have no idea if I'll be able to find this thing online, but <laughs> I will look for something similar for you guys. Who knows? This is probably years and years old, which is really gross, but it went with the outfit. So <laughs> this scrunchie is from Urban Outfitters, I think. It has little red strawberries all over it. My bralette that I love is from Tilly's. My friend Grace gave it to me. I think it's so cute and feminine and I love it. Sweater is from Princess Polly Boutique. You guys saw if you watched my haul video. My leggings, all time faves, the Lululemon Alliance. Best leggings ever, especially for lounging at home. They're not like a high performance workout legging or anything like that. They're just perfect for every day. And then my fuzzy socks, probably Amazon. I probably got them in a gift or something, but I'll find similar ones. Here's one more view of the outfit. On to outfit number three. All right, now to outfit number three. This is probably my favorite. The picture's somewhere on the screen of the whole thing. This top comes really low, so sorry about that. Okay, I pulled it back a little, so I think I fixed it. But this is like my signature lazy day hair style. If you know me, you know that I wear this hair. 24 7 when I'm at home. It's just the best if you have long hair. Same necklace as last time. This little cardigan, really, really comfy, fluffy thing. This was actually my grandma's that she gave to me. I've been wearing it a ton during this quarantine and I'll try to link something similar to it down below if I can find anything. I really love it. The shirt is from Tilly's. Moving on, these shorts are actually from Amazon. They have little milk and cookies all over them. I just think they're so cute. And then same slippers as the first outfit. This is just the most comfortable. Like, I don't want to take this off to show you guys the other outfits. It is that. Comfy. I should not be touching my face. So, see if her outfit number four. I'm messing that up. It's not three, it's four. 
All right, it is time for the second to last outfit. This is outfit number four. This is a little athleisure home workout outfit. I figured I know home workouts have been circulating all over Instagram. So I was like, why not give you guys a little workout outfit idea? This is my go-to leggings and a sports bra is what is the most comfortable to work out in for me. And obviously it's been cold out. So I just have this little jacket from Puma. I got this on sale somewhere, probably another Nordstrom Rack find. I'm gonna find it for you guys, don't worry. I feel like this video, I've been showing really random items in my outfit but I'll try to find it all for you. My sports bra is from Victoria's Secret. I got this on sale too. It looks all normal from the front if I just go like that. But if you take back the sleeves, you can see it has this really cute thing. It says Victoria's Sport on it. I don't know if this is in focus, but here's what the back looks like. This little crisscross type thing going on. Okay, and moving right along. These pants, I'm cheating on Lululemon. <laughs> these are from Athleta. I've had these for a very long time. I think they might even be like kid size, but they're such a cute pattern and they do feel really similar to the Lululemon leggings. So comfy. Finally, my shoes are Adidas. And now for the final outfit. Okay, I have to do this quick because my sister's waiting on me for something else. But headband I got at Forever 21. A really long time ago it was for the 4th of July, I think, but they still have it online, I believe. This sweatshirt that is my fave, it was actually my brother's that he gave to me. Anyway, I just thought the red headband would be cute because it has a little hint of red in the logo right here. This is my favorite color ever. Actually, not my favorite color, but one of my favorite colors of all time. And this sweatshirt is so, so comfy. Same Lululemon leggings that I had on in the other outfit in this video, the Aligns, best leggings ever. And then these socks, I honestly have no idea where these are from. These were in a gift. So that is the final outfit and that marks the end of this video thank you guys so much for watching if you want me to do more fashion videos in the future and while this quarantine is going on forever by the way don't mind this dye in my eye thumbs up this video thank you guys so much for 14,000 subscribers i'm so grateful and i'm so happy that our little family on youtube is growing so quickly please subscribe and join us if you've not already hope you guys are staying safe and healthy and i will see you very soon with a new video bye guys Mwah.